In addition to doing traditional pancreas surgery, we've become very uh, experienced and uh, accomplished at doing minimally invasive surgery using a robot to perform both a Whipple procedure, distal pancreatectomy, and even in some unique circumstances, total pancreatectomy. We're finding that the outcomes with this operation are just as safe as those with traditional surgery and may have some benefits for patients in terms of their recovery and their return to normal life. We see a lot of patients that have uh, tumors that involve the blood vessels around the pancreas. These are often patients with borderline resectable cancers where the superior mesenteric vein or the portal vein is affected by the tumor. We've had years and years of experience dealing with these types of problems and have a team that can either replace part of that vein, remove the entire vessel and reconstruct it, um, or in, sometimes, uh, in some cases where we can remove the vessel without reconstructing it. Based on some of the um, unique ability to predict the blood vessel involvement based on our imaging techniques and our surgeon's experience, we can really customize the procedure for those patients. For patients that have tumor that contacts the artery to the liver, um, those patients have traditionally not been off surgery, offered surgery if the um, hepatic artery is involved. And so we can remove the tumor and the um, lymphatic channels along the hepatic artery, what we consider a periadventitial dissection or an arterial divestment of the tumor. Occasionally though, the artery has to be removed and we do have the ability to allow circumflex blood flow to the liver without reconstructing the artery or occasionally partnering with our vascular or transplant surgeons to reconstruct the hepatic artery. The most challenging problem for a lot of patients with pancreas cancer is involvement of the superior mesenteric artery. Again, we use the techniques of dissecting along the outside of the artery wall to remove all the nerves and lymphatic tissue along the superior mesenteric artery while preserving the normal blood flow to the intestine. This unique procedure allows us to have a high rate of complete resection of tumors without requiring reconstruction of the artery or compromise of blood flow to the intestine. Traditionally, patients who have pancreas cancer when it spreads to other parts of the body have not benefited from surgery. As we've seen some advances in chemotherapy for pancreas cancer, we've started to realize that a select group of patients may be eligible. We've been studying patients who have tumor that spreads to the liver but no other organs, and we've been able to do surgery in a growing number of those patients. Over the last number of years, we've seen some very promising outcomes and are starting to offer that unique procedure of removing the pancreas tumor as well as the metastasis to the liver for some of these patients. Music